In today's video guys, we are going to be going over some new leaks that just surfaced and these leaks do sound a bit interesting and I'm going to be giving you guys my honest opinion and if I think that these are real. Again guys, please do keep everything with a grain of salt while going into this and I'm going to be giving you guys my honest thoughts at the very end of this video and deciding if it's fake or true. But the fabrication of this is already kind of un truthful but let's just get right into this video guys starting out guys krauser is not cut from the game and his role is expanded in a very interesting way he's not the person who kidnaps ashley anymore and the knife fight is still in the game luis gets an expanded storyline with flashbacks and also some scenes with his grandpa the minigun guy is cut from the game but the rocket launcher guys aren't Regenerators have a scarier design. The first Iron Maiden has a scientist body impaled onto its spike. And Salazar is still a midget and has a creepier personality. To top it all off, Salazar only has one vertigo protecting him this time and he is a stalker in the castle. You can down him but you can't kill him because later in the game he gets combined with Salazar. The Big Cheese also has an expanded storyline and works like Mr. X in the village portion of the game. His final form is still the centipede monster and you still fight him in the barn. Del Lago boss fight is significantly different working similar to the Moreau fight in village and yes if you shoot the water you still get the jump scare but it doesn't eat you this time. You just see a really big shadow swimming to the other side of the lake. Ashley's portion in the castle is longer, but she can use a knife this time. Ashley's AI is much better, and she can throw objects at the enemies like rocks. And finally, two demos are scheduled to release in January 2023. One village demo and one castle demo, just like village. Alright guys, so I mean, we went through almost all the leaks and... To give you guys my honest opinion, this just seems very fabricated and kind of dishonest. That's the thing with a lot of leaks, you really do need to take it with a grain of salt. But some things kind of add up. I mean, we heard reports in the past that a demo was coming at some point, um, but I didn't. I don't think that Resident Evil 4 Remake will get demoed that soon. You know, maybe a month or two before the game launches. I mean, it's supposed to be launching in March of 2023 i mean that's quite a bit away you know why would we get it in january i mean for people to experience something that monumental i mean resident evil 4 is regarded as one of the greatest games of all time heck it's even my favorite resident evil game, right but i mean i don't know man it, it just kind of seems odd right but then to top it all off resident evil 4 is also seen a lot of uh the leaks have also heard a lot of cuts when it comes to cut content and Krauser is cut that's what a lot of reports are saying but I don't know man it's, that's just a hard thing to believe nowadays but man that's gonna have to wrap up today's video guys but if you really do ask me I mean I don't know take it with a grain of salt I mean some things could end up being true some things could be cancelled I don't know that's the thing about the game development a lot of conceptual phases do go when you come so you really gotta really hold out there but other than that guys i'll see you guys in the next video thank you guys so much for watching and i'll catch you guys later peace out